Uh, Make It is an image campaign. It was set up by the Manufacturing Institute, um, but it's really led by manufacturers for manufacturers. And the idea being that manufacturers were saying they couldn't find the right people with the right skills, and so it was adversely affecting their businesses. And one of the big barriers to young people wanting to enter manufacturing is the poor image of the sector. So generally when you talk to young people and say, you know, what do you think about manufacturing? They'll say it's, it's low paid and it's low status and there aren't any jobs in the UK anymore. So we set Make It Up to actually counteract some of those myths and show young people that there are exciting, rewarding careers in manufacturing for them. The main aims and objectives of Make It are to widen young people's horizons really about manufacturing because I think if you talk to most kids they think manufacturing is about working on a production line and actually it has moved on incredibly since um, the ideas of the dark satanic mills and people doing boring jobs, banging widgets and it's really about providing young people with an informed choice so saying actually think about the trainers you wear and the iPod you listen to and how did that come into being and think about all the different jobs that have been included in that from innovation to R&D right through to logistics. So it's about giving them an idea of the breadth of different opportunities that sit within manufacturing. Within Make It we've got quite a few different um, programmes of activity for life. So we run Make It Enterprising Challenges where young people have to create new products, they have to build them, they have to market them, they have to pitch their ideas to set of dragons and a dragon's den type activity. Um, we're heavily involved in Skills Northwest. We have one of the biggest, most interactive stands there, which is facilitated by the manufacturers themselves. We run placement days for teachers. We organize factory visits. Um, there's a whole range of things, depending on what the manufacturers themselves want, because we're very much led by their demand, really. The feedback um, from everybody involved in Make It has been overwhelmingly positive and I think you can see that in that the, the partners we started out with initially about three years ago have continued to work with us and, and have grown their involvement in the campaign. So they're doing it because they can tell that it raises their profile as an employer of choice, that it develops their existing staff. Um, but also is encouraging more young people to go into the sector in the future. It's creating that pipeline of talent for them. Um, and the kids themselves, you know, they are genuinely surprised when they hear about the salaries you can earn in the sector, the different types of jobs, the different skills that are required. Um, and the teachers, actually, because there's quite a lot of work involved in um, bringing teachers up to speed with actually the realities of modern manufacturing. Make It's just going to grow. It's just going to grow. We've got more manufacturers all the time wanting to get involved. The manufacturers we're already working with want to do more with us. I think there are lots of challenges facing the sector and we need to be ready to meet those challenges and we need to have the right people with the right skills if we're going to create that strong manufacturing base for the UK. Um, so I've, I've every confidence that it's just going to go from strength to strength.